Today we're going to be working on our core. You're going to need a dumbbell. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to be doing a feet to the sky corkscrew. And just like the way the name sounds, we're going to be doing a lot of twists, a lot of shift, working our abs, our lower back, bringing in a little bit of everything, majority of our core. Following that, we're going to be doing figure eights to where you're grabbing a dumbbell and you're literally doing a figure eight. So sounds kind of weird, but it's actually pretty tough. So core screws, we're going to go for 10 on each side and figure eights, we're going to go for 20 figure eights. So 10 on each side for corkscrews, 20 figure eights, that equals one round, and I want you to go ahead and go for five rounds. I'm gonna demo one round for you, and then you can do the rest. Okay, so corkscrews. Uh, feet to sky corkscrews, you wanna hold a dumbbell like this, and you wanna swing and raise up right here, and come back down. One, two, it's almost like, imagine you have a bucket of water and you're trying to throw the water over your shoulder. So if it's like a bucket, you're like that. Okay. Four. Five. Keep your abs tight. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Other side. pound so you don't need to go really heavy on this if you don't have weights you can actually go with maybe a heavy book uh, maybe like a backpack or anything that's around 10 15 pounds would work good okay so figure eights so here's a tip on figure eights when you're coming you want to make a circle down a circle down so this way you're creating a figure eight, but make sure as you're coming down, that you come down, circle, and down. So really emphasize that down part, because that's gonna really work the core. Okay, you can grab it this way, or grab it this way. One, two, three. Cheating. The way you do it, I'm gonna do a few reps for y'all on the actual right form. Instead of coming back like this, try to keep it in front of you. And down, and down, and down, and down. This way it works more your core. So as you get fatigued, your form kind of starts to go bad, so just kind of keep that in mind. So you want to do about five sets of these, and I guarantee your abs, not just that, but by the time you're done, shoulders, your back, your lower back, even part of your legs, you're gonna feel it. It's gonna work all of it. Awesome, awesome exercise to strengthen your core and also get six-pack abs without having to do any type of crunches or sit-ups. <laughs> 